Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. For today's puzzle it is the RGS Harley Davidson by Paul Traveller. I'm hoping I'm pronouncing that correctly. Um, he's a South African artist from Joburg. Um, it's my first puzzle by him as artist and but there is a couple of more puzzles issued by or pro produced by RGS. I'm definitely going to look out for them and so if I get some I will share with you as well. I will drop a link to his website in the description box below. So please go check it out. It's really beautiful artwork. Um, I will talk to you about him and the puzzle during the course of the time lapse. I um, hope you enjoy it. I appreciate your time. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Puzzle is by RGS. The name is Holly Davidson and the artist is Paul Trevelin. I did a full flip here and as I flipped I took out all the red pieces which was the most obvious color. Um, I did not start with the edge as per usual. The edge is just dark all around there wasn't much uh, to work off so I started with the signs. Um, they went well or together well. I had no problem with those. The Differences between the reds were quite distinguishable enough. After the reds, I think it was white and then the yellows. I also did the yellow little piece of sunset there at the top. And um, as I went up, I then included the edge pieces. Um, from there, I went down to the bike. And um, when I get there, I will um, talk to you further about that. For now, I just want to touch on the artist, which is Paul Trevelin. Um, Paul Trevelin was born and raised in Johannesburg, South Africa. He served in the South African Air Force in the early 80s in the Anglo-Angolan War. This is where his love affair with air aircraft started and he spent his free time sketching. Paul went on to become a SWAT paramedic and a captain in the emergency services in South Africa and crewed an EMS helicopter for many years. After almost losing his life in a rescue operation, he decided to leave the service and has been painting in oils ever since. Paul is a self-taught artist and has paintings across the globe. Owners of his work include the Smithsonian F and Space Museum John Travoldra, Celine Dion, Nelson Mandela, SAAB Air, Aerospace, Virgin Atlantic, Southwest Airlines, etc. Um, he's got a couple of his artwork um, being produced as puzzles by RGS. I think there's, there's at least four more um, by him that I'm going to look for. One is a, a mini and a... The other one is a F1 race car and there is a scooter, I think, yeah. And um, I quite enjoyed his artwork even though it is, um, this one was very dark, uh, for, especially at the bottom. You will see uh, I start with the bike and uh, there's mostly... It looks silver on the on the picture, or it's supposed to be silver, but if you look at the um, pieces, it's basically grey. So you've got grey and you've got black. And um, that part of the motorbike, the motor part, is everything looks the same. It's liney and stripy and the colours are exactly the same. And it took me a while to, to figure out where the machine part of the bike um, went. Um, the wheels were a bit better. Um, there was different colors of gray for the inner tires and there was the spikes and the spikes on the back and the front didn't look exactly the same. So that, that went better. But yeah, you can see I put in the, um, the bottom edge. It's black. It's totally black. I think if I remember correctly, at some point I am going to um, sort the sh the pieces by shape um, just to make it a bit easier. But you are nothing for this puzzle went as per usual. Um, usually I would do the edge first. I would split the edge, bring the top down and um, bolt down and move up as I go. 
Um, but yeah, still I enjoyed it. Luckily, I am not afraid of a challenge. And this one was a little bit more of a challenge to me. Only because of the darker pieces. But uh, the artwork is beautiful. I really enjoyed it. And I look forward to do these others. The mini and the... Um, scooter i think is more colorful it's, there's more blues in there so i will definitely do another one before i form an opinion of his artwork as um, puzzles but you're yeah, regardless of the dog pieces and the difficult part in the the motor of the motorbike i did enjoy it um i'm going to drop a link to his website in the description box so you are welcome to go and have a look at his other artwork. It is really beautiful. And it um, because it's mostly vehicles and trains and um, aircrafts and ships, I think the men among the viewers will enjoy his artwork a lot more than the ladies. Personally, I would have loved if he just added a little bit of a, a flower or something. Only if it was a dandelion. I think that would have made a little bit of a difference here at the bottom for at least four or five pieces just to to break that dark um, bottom. But yeah, still, I enjoyed it. Um, go check out his other artwork. I appreciate the time that you spent watching this video. And um, I hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you in the next one. Take care.